Welcome to Samsung Games, the place to find new strategy games. It's only been a matter of time before we play a game like this. So we're gonna be playing Kavit Kavai and it's a tower defense game. We're gonna be playing two levels here because I want to show some things off. We're gonna start off with the frozen foods we'll be playing on normal. What's interesting about this game is that you have two types of currencies. One is the toilet paper and this is like the typical currency that you use to build towers and things like that. And then you've got dollars here and you can use the dollars for permanent upgrades that remain between different levels but also between different difficulties. So the way this works is since you're gonna play the normal until you get a really good uh, towers with the dollars and then you are going to play on hard once you kind of learn that so first thing we're going to do is we're going to play some towers i have unlocked three different types of tower we have the hand sanitizer which is a damage of four the range of eight and speed of three a sanitation necessity kills germs on contact weekly bar so this is essentially high damage low range low speed and hand soap, which is a poison damage. This also necessitates does poison damage over time to those pesky viruses. So let's start this off by placing a hand sanitizer here. We're gonna place one poison thing here in the back and another hand sanitizer in the front. And that's it. We're gonna wait for the bar soap before we use up the rest. You can also check out the different viruses. Over here we've got Kavona, Flying Kavona, Rolling Rona. They're quite cute. I think it's, it's kind of fun. The way this works, by the way, that if only one of these viruses moves through to here towards the end, it's game over. So it's not like you can let certain amounts through, but just one and then it's over. There is another level that behaves quite differently so I'm going to show that off a bit later. Now you can upgrade these things. If you upgrade them you're going to increase the speed or damage per second as you can see over here. So what we're going to do is we're going to upgrade these two. Probably this one as well and then we'll build a bar soap. Mainly because I want to show you the animation on the bar soap. As we kill enemies we gain more toilet paper which we use for this stuff and occasionally more dollars as well. We can also speed it up over here. If we wanted to, I'm doing pretty okay so far. We're gonna place the bar soap here and there because as they move through, it's going to be pretty beneficial to do some nice damage that way. But we seem to be destroying them pretty nicely. Ooh, look at these big guys. They're a bit more, uh, they have a bit more HP as they kind of roll through. All right, we need to get to 30 in order to be able to place the bar soap. So I'm gonna speed up the time because there's nothing we can do anyways. I mean, we could do like upgrades, but we're not gonna. Ooh, two more, two more. I'm gonna say I love how this is like thrown off. So these guys are essentially faster, so the idea is that they... The fact that they're flying doesn't really matter because you attack flying or walking, it's just that they're faster, so it's kind of like to show show that. I was gonna say I love how... I, I wonder who made this fall and then just kind of left it there, like, come on. Like, I know we're panicking, but are we panicking enough to leave these things on the floor? And why is no one picking it up? <laughs> like, just gonna leave it there. Just gonna leave it. Alright, um... Do we wanna... We could upgrade again, or build a new thing. Let's build... We're we gonna wait for another poison thing. And there's another level which I'm gonna show you soon. This is much better for poisoning. Yeah, the poisoning is good, but it's not necessarily the greatest thing to go with. But uh, as we're gonna move further, there will be a really good level for that. So let's, we need 40 for this. So we, we don't have, yeah, now, go. And we're gonna see this super big thing. Let's see if we can kill it. Now the poison damage on this thing should be quite cool because as it moves, it should take a lot more damage that way. Nice. Got 15 levels, by the way. Uh, I'm gonna upgrade these. So these are interesting. They have this little, almost like shield and once you destroy the shield only, then you can hit them up. I only have eight dollars. Once you get to 19, you could actually do some good stuff, but until then, not much you can do. Alright, I wanted to upgrade something. You. Yeah. I also want to build an additional tower, so I'm really seem to be handling it. But I do like the idea of this sort of like permanent upgrade because essentially it makes you like repeat the game on normal difficulty, and then sort of once you get enough, you can go into hard. This is gonna be really, really cool. Yeah, I don't think we need to build anymore. This is the this is the last wave to 15 waves, so we're not gonna. Even though I've got like plenty of this to do it. Yeah, we have one. Right. 
COVID-19 negative, additional testing, awesomeness A positive, awesomeness B positive, patient social games. I quite like that. I got ones like deserves the reward positive, got a reward negative. That was pretty funny. Let's go place produce circle because this level is a little bit different than the rest of them. The way this works is that the enemies move in and then they're going to keep moving in the circle forever forever it's just quite interesting that's why it's very useful to have these sort of poison thing we're actually gonna do it go with two poison and one regular one and once you get to 100 viruses here then it's game over but it's really interesting because since they're gonna keep moving having these kind of poison things are really good by the way you might notice when we click here on towers that some of these have extra star that's because i've leveled them up over here with my with my dollars uh, I've clicked on them to make them a little bit stronger. So I have upgraded the poison thing and the regular thing. Probably if we get to 19, I'm actually going to unlock a new tower. It's probably not the best decision game has, but I want to show off the different towers that the game has to offer so that you guys can see it with me. The two poison are actually doing quite well. The difference and difficulty between normal and hard is actually quite steep. Like if we were playing this on hard around wave 6 or 7, we would kind of be, be over with this particular composition. So you really want to make sure that you can level up your towers before you go to the higher difficulty, at least from how I've played it so far. Alright, let's add another poison tower. This is going to be all about poison here, really. And then we're going to start upgrading all of them a little bit so that we can uh, mostly so that they can shoot a little bit faster because this, this will allow us to poison them a bit more which is going to be really really good you don't have to worry about them you know like running away because they're just going to go a full circle and then can poison them again and again and again and if you just don't get too many it's okay the problem in this particular level is you get a lot of the tiny ones because they still count as one even though they're tiny so uh, if you get like 30 of these tiny ones, the poison towers aren't very quick in killing the tiny ones and we only have one of these regular towers. So what can happen to you is that you just won't be able to hurt them in time. See like these ones because the, actually here we're handling it pretty well but on hard. You know the poison towers are going to shoot like a few of these and then they're going to be like yeah I can't do anything so yeah. Let's place another regular one here. And I might go with the, one of the bar, bar soaps here and here, and then we're probably gonna mirror it down in this. Actually, we might just go poison down here. So we'll have a couple of these regular ones. We'll place another bar, bar soap here, and then we'll just have poison. Poison on. This one, by the way, has 20 ways. All right, we've got enough money. So let's unlock a brand new tower. So we're gonna get a new delivery. Ooh, what is this? Disinfecting spray. Big spray damage to all viruses in its path. It smells pine fresh. Alright, how much does it cost though? 50. So same range as the hand soap. Slightly higher damage, but it does like a spray damage on multiple people. I'll try to place it down here. I will need to get to 50 first. It's going to take a little while. I'm going to place it here. I don't know if, if the enemies are ever going to get to it, but we'll see. Okay, they are good. Let's place the spray here. Ooh, nice. So this is going to be really good against those tiny ones because you can just like spray them out, which is quite nice. But you're going to see here, it's going to move around and just kind of join. Okay, it didn't. It didn't manage to get that far, but it would have. All right, let's place another bar soap here. We'll do another spray and he'll put the poison. I just like having it like symmetrical. So that's why we're just going to do it. We don't really need to worry about it. We're going to win this, no stress. But yeah. Right, let's let's speed it up even more. We're doing quite well. Ooh, I like destroying these ones. It was only this easy to destroy the viruses in real life. But then again, we are playing on normal. There's also a difficulty called pandemic, so <laughs> probably be a bit harder on that one. But you know, we're doing what we can. Ooh, this bar soap looks so cool. Oh, these rolling guys are quite nice. Oh, I'm destroying them by so Nice. And we're almost at 30, which is not enough because we need 40, but... <laughs> Why did you tell me that then? Well, I just wanted to check if you're paying attention. I am paying attention. Good. <laughs> oh, come on. Give me, give me a bit more. Give me. Yes. Hands up. I might say it's not symmetrical right now. I know, but like the plan is symmetrical. 
This goes into poison and this is gonna be things gonna be fine. But it doesn't look symmetrical. Well that's true. <laughs> Alright, come on, keep going. Destroy all my enemies. Let's uh, let's speed it up to the fastest speed. We can see we only have like 14 at a time and we're already at wave 19. The highest level is 20, so again, not too stressed about it. Alright, let's place the disinfecting spray there. Probably won't be able to f place all the towers before it's game over, but we will certainly try. Who are like that? Oh, they're spreading these tiny ones and we're just decimating them. This spray is really good for the tiny ones, I like that a lot. Alright, let's place another hand soap and another hand soap. We made it! Full circle! Ooh, come on, keep destroying them. That's the speed. Yeah, we're doing no stress. That'd be great. I could upgrade my towers, but again... Oh, at least I can now show you they're gonna move around. In case you didn't believe me, we're like, no, it's gonna be game over once they move to here. It's not. This is just keep moving. No need to worry. Now we're gonna destroy them. Nice! The spray did the final damage. Can I do the same with the other one? I don't think so. Mm, yes. The spray was the hero. And 281 toilet paper. Patient Samster Games, negative, additional testing wins levels, positive, loses levels, negative. I quite like that. Well, I think this is a good time to end the episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, write on the comments. You can click on the right to watch some other tower defenses. I'll see you there. Bye-bye.